Guys, I'm about to be locked in the basement of the Winchester Mystery Mansion all by myself. The first ever. What's up guys, I'm Mo Sergeant. Welcome back to episode two at the Winchester Mystery House. Today I am joined here with my best friend, Joey Official over here. Nice little fam. And I got the new homie, Jake. He works here, he's been showing us around. Really, really cool person. Um, this place is super duper haunted. We've caught a lot of stuff in episode one, which I already posted. If you haven't seen it, the link is down below. Omar is upstairs with Suzanne. Um, they're investigating some paranormal activity upstairs. If you don't know about this place, watch episode one to figure out what's going on. The largest, ab not abandoned, but the largest haunted mansion in probably, I'd say the world, in my opinion. I didn't show you guys the basement in episode one. The saying is, is that there's a ghost that carries a wheelbarrow, pushes a wheel wheelbarrow around in the basement. Um, we're gonna go down to the basement, we're gonna explore, I'm gonna show it to you guys. I'm gonna use some night vision, which I didn't get to use in episode one. So, smash the like button, go show Joey some love. I would not be here without him. <laughs> and uh, subscribe to his channel. Also, subscribe to me if you haven't subscribed. Let's get on this adventure. Okay guys, so right now I'm in the kitchen. I'm about to make my way down to the basement, but the reason why I wanted to show you guys this part of the kitchen, because I've never seen it yet, I didn't get to see in the other episode. Is there another kitchen or is this just it? There's five more. Five more kitchens? Yeah. Whoa. Interesting. Okay, so I need you guys to do me a big solid favor. Keep your eyes. What was that? Okay, so you're gonna be hearing a lot of weird things throughout the video. Make sure you guys comment it down below. This place has <laughs> over 40 ghosts living in here. A lot of things went down in episode one. Um, Episode two, I'm expecting some crazier things to happen because we're gonna go down to the basement. But as I was trying to say, keep your eyes wide open in case you guys do spot something. Um, like I said, if you do, pin it down in the comments below. Joey, you okay? Yeah. Joey's still freaking out because he yeah. literally got touched by something. And uh, where are we going? Okay. Down this way. Let Jake lead the way. Whoa. Guessing that's another kitchen. No way, that's the basement. That's the basement entrance? Yep. Oh. Holy moly. Oh, no way, dude. No way. There is no way we're going down here. Oh, that is beautiful. Look at this. Okay, so this is the basement entrance. I'm going to be using thermal. I'm going to be using night vision. Can you guys lock me down here by myself for a little bit? Yeah. You actually can? Yeah. Go ahead. Let me work up to this. Not right now. <laughs> Let me work up to this, guys. Check it out. Making my way down into the basement of the Winchester Mystery Mansion. This is the coolest thing ever. Cool. Hello, Mr. Wheelbarrow Ghost. If you're here. Ooh, it's chilly down here. Yep. We are underground, I think. Okay, making my way throughout the basement. Like I said, I haven't been here just yet. There are some robes here in the way because they don't want the tourists to, you know, people to wander off sometimes. Is, huh? Oh, it's not this way? Uh, it is, but you want to go this way. It's better. All right, let's go. Bro, this looks like something out of a mental asylum. Look at that elevator over there. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Dude, this is like a maze. Whoa. There's so much to look at, which is why I saved this for another episode. Oh my God, you guys need to be smashing that like button right now. A lot of you paranormal investigators dream of coming here and I've brought it to you guys. So, I hope you appreciate this. We're doing this for y'all. I want you guys to feel like you're a part of the adventure, to see this with your own eyes. I want you guys to keep your eyes wide open and let me know if you see a ghost anywhere. Someone with a wheelbarrow. There might be someone with a wheelbarrow. We might see it, we might not, I don't know. Oh, big steps. Look at this furnace. This is what they would use to heat up this entire house if it ever got cold here. I can't imagine it getting cold, as cold as it gets back home in Canada, but you never know sometimes. 
Unbelievable. Look at all this. Damn. I'm guessing they used to store coal in there. Something. Yeah, look at this. Coal and rock. I cannot wait to start using my night vision down here and thermal. So the reason why I want to use thermal down here is because it's cold down here. It's chilly. Things shouldn't be warm down below. If we get a heat signature on the thermal camera, it means there could be something. What was that? Thought I seen something walk by me. Hmm. Okay, it's just you sitting here. <laughs> Scare the crap out of me. <laughs> Are there any ghosts down here? <laughs> Who is that? Joey? Joey's sitting over there in the corner. If there are any ghosts down here with wheelbarrows, where did you say they've seen the wheelbarrows? Down, down there. Down that down hallway? Where, Joey's where, at. where Joey's sitting? Yep. So Joey, the ghost with the wheelbarrow apparently gets spotted where you're sitting. I know. That's exactly where I'm sitting here. You're trying to spot him. Hmm. There's something flashing in your pocket. In your back pocket. Back pocket? I got it on camera. I don't know what that was. Hmm, that's very weird. Huh? I That's very weird. I seen something like flashing back there. Maybe it would have been my oh, it's my light on your zipper thing. Oh. So the guy with the wheelbarrow can be seen here. Yep, this is called Steam Alley. So we're in the furnace. There's a lot of steam that would get relieved down here. Okay. Uh, so he's seen pushing coal, kind of going around the corner behind. behind so, you. so there actually was a guy, like a real guy in time. That would yep. push a, a barrel here with coal. Yep. So it's the guy we saw um, in the upstairs. picture. Yeah, in the picture. Whoa. Um, so the if, overalls. if you don't know what I'm talking about, the link is down below, pinned to the top. Make sure you guys watch it to understand the story of the ghost that lives down here um, with the wheelbarrow. Some people have actually caught it on camera. Dude, my stomach is feeling like crap right now. What do we have to eat earlier? That soy uh, bean burger. No, it was Omar's pizza. Omar's pizza? Yeah, it must be it, or I don't know, something's doing this to me, but I don't feel good. Oh, this is very weird. I'm getting a really cold vibe in here now. Any ghosts down here? Hello? Anyone down here? edge right now I am on edge look at this more coal over here I'm guessing they would feed the coal through like a hole over there and they would come down here and they would scoop it and look at this it's a wheelbarrow this is what the ghost or the guy with the wheelbarrow will push I kind of want to get locked down here yes. <laughs> by myself but I don't know if I've built up to that just yet but hey we should do it right guys it's a good idea a good bad idea Look at this elevator over here. What an old elevator. Really cool. What's wrong? I want to see you get locked down here in the basement. That's you, you, want, you want to see you get locked down here? Yeah, that'll be you. You. <laughs> Why do I always have to try to prove myself? All right. I'll do it. I want to be down here alone for five minutes in total. Five whole minutes. Okay. Start a timer. Five whole minutes I'm gonna spend down here. If I don't do it, what do I what do I do? No, not only that, you can't just stay in one position. No, I'll walk around. Okay, okay. Yeah, okay. I've done worse things than this. Are you gonna use the night vision camera? No. <laughs> yeah, use the no, night vision. No camera. lights out challenge. No, no lights out, out challenge right now. <laughs> I'll use the night vision after I survive the five minutes down here. So Alright boys. Alright, we're gonna go back up and oh, is this the way to back up? Oh we're gonna walk Okay, Alright. I think I'm going to be the first person to ever get locked in the basement of the Winchester house. <laughs> oh man. 
So I'm gonna follow them back outside to prove to you guys that I'm here by myself. Careful from the stairs. Well, I'm not gonna go up these stairs. Not you, the wheelbarrow guy might come down the stairs. <laughs> if she comes here, I'm gonna buy him a drink. Alright, Mo, you might want to take a shot of this because Okay, I'm getting nervous. Guys, I'm about to be locked in the basement of the Winchester Mystery Mansion all by myself. The first ever. Shit. It's happened. It's happened. Alright, let me prove to you guys that it's locked. <laughs> there you go. Five minutes, start the counter. There we go. It's the middle of the night. It's currently it's currently 12.07 a.m. And I'm locked down here by myself. I'm going to explore and see if I capture anything. I'm on edge. Please don't make any noises either. Shit, man. All right, what did I get myself into? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, if my light fails, I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry hard. Hello? Hello? Mr. Wheelbarrow Ghost? I'm actually nervous now. Hello, Mr. Ghost, are you here? Okay. I'm gonna keep this footage rolling for five minutes straight. Not. Not. Not gonna have any edit cuts at all for five minutes. And hopefully I can get something on camera. Time to move along. What's through here? Oh shit, shit. I really hope you guys are, are feeling for me right now. I feel like something's walking my shit. All right, get, get a grip of yourself, Mo. It's probably just Omar and Suzanne walking upstairs. Please God, keep me safe. My only concern is, is if I go into the deep dark alley, and if that door closes behind me, I'm literally gonna crap my pants. Shit. I heard something, man. I heard something. Hello? I come in peace. And hopefully I can leave in one piece. Guys, smash that like button. Because I don't see any other YouTubers that do this besides me. Okay, so this is Wheelbarrow Alley. Fuck shit. Fuck. And I'm gonna sit here. And explore. If anybody comes right now, I'm gonna flip out. I'm, I'm getting aggravated as it is. Okay, so I've reached a dead end in the alleyway right now. Every part of my body does not want to continue. Every part of my body wants to run out of here like a little girl. But then again, I know some girls that are pretty tough, so some girls won't even run out of here. But I'm the first person alive to be locked in the basement of the Winchester Mystery House. And 
when I say the word alive, I stress on it and I hope it stays that way. So I'm covering all my angles. I'm starting to freak out now. I don't remember where I came in from. I literally do not remember where I came in from. If you guys see some sort of like wheelbarrow guy, let me know in the comments below because I don't know, man. Like I, I don't see. It. Hold on. Let me see if I can make my light even brighter. Okay, no, no, no. Okay, there we go. That's the brightest setting. Do you guys see some sort of wheelbarrow guy? Let me know in the comments below. Keep in mind, I'm keeping this entire clip unedited. And I'm making my way through the basement. Oh, shit! What was that? Hello? Hello? Oh, fuck. Mr. Wheelbarrow Guy? Guys, I didn't make it to the steam furnace yet. I'm gonna go off and see if I can get this guy on camera. What I just did there is I turned off my light to see if I can cap, what the hell was that? I turned off my light to see if I can capture anything in the dark Please God, keep me protected in this basement. Oh, the darkness plays tricks on you. Look, I've made it to the furnace, which is cool. By myself, first person to ever do this, ever. Let's head back to the door and see if those guys are there. Let's see if the door is still locked. Thing is, is I don't remember where I came from. I think it was this way. I think I came from here. I don't remember these doors being this open like this. Okay. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> are you trying to prank me? Are you trying to prank me? Wait, wait. Have, how long have you guys been down here? Yeah, like a couple minutes. Okay, but I passed, I think. I've been down here for a while, by myself. Yeah. 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 That's freaky being down here by yourself. <clears throat> so, these guys tried to prank me. But I did it. I did. Am I the first person to get locked down here? And to my knowledge, yeah. Hell yeah. Most are well, he, he literally locked the door. Yeah, I know. I saw it. Like locked. it's locked. Which way did you guys come down from? Over here. Oh, okay. So, there you go. Mission accomplished. I don't think I captured anybody on camera or any real burrow person, but I'm gonna bust out the night vision camera right now. Are you guys ready for that? Cool. We're gonna be in the complete darkness. No flashlights allowed. Cool. Watch your heads though. You guys are gonna rely on my camera and my screen to see. All right guys, so we got some night vision going on here right now. We have all our lights turned off. No one is using a flashlight at the moment. And we're in the basement, all three of us. Omar's still upstairs, he should have met us here. Hopefully he's not dead. And if he is, it's content, but hopefully he's not dead. Um, <laughs> I'm just going to take you guys quickly through the alley over here. Mr. Wheelbarrow Man. <laughs> I hit my head on the butt. <laughs> Mr. Wheelbarrow Man. That was funny, huh? <laughs> what the hell's touching my shoulder? What's touching my shoulder? Not me. Over the pipes. No, something literally just touched my shoulder. Mr. Wheelbarrow Man, are you here? So I must stay really ducked down, just in case. Well, my camera is really like going out of focus down here right now. All right, you guys. <laughs> it's so hard to to just walk down here because I can't see a thing. Mr. Wheelbarrow Man, Joey likes to laugh every time I say Mr. Wheelbarrow Man for some reason. But like that's who he is. He's a ghost with a wheelbarrow. Yo, my EMF spiking crazy. Come over here. It's spiking? Yeah, look. Yo. Holy crap. Can I board that for a second? Yes. Thank you. So as we're progressing into the basement, Joey's EMF reader is per, uh, spiking. There's a light source over there. 
Might be coming from a window. Mr. Wheelbarrow Man, can you please show yourself to us? I think I earned it. I spent five minutes down here all by myself. So right now the ghost meter isn't really doing much. Will you reveal yourself? I literally w just want to talk to you. That's it. That's all. Nothing else. Don't want to collect on no rent or nothing, but just talk to you. Here, Joey. Mm -hmm. Bro, this oh, is... Call him Clyde. Clyde? Yeah. Clyde! Yo, you said his name is Spiked. Clyde, are you here? Holy shit, it's spiking right now. All right, hey, I got a, I got a, I got my, uh, my uh, spirit box. Clyde, are you here right now? Look at the, look at my unit. Huh? I, I heard a voice. Clyde, are you down here? Clyde, are you down here? Mr. Wheelbarrow Man, are you here? What was that? Ghost with the wheelbarrow. You can communicate to us through this device. Will you communicate with us? So that alley down there is where he's been seen. Yeah. Did you hear that? What did he say? He said, shut up. No. I swear to God. You said, yeah, down there? Yep. That's okay. Like a yell? Yeah. Yeah. Let's go down to where he's been seen exactly. Sure. And post up there. Hello, are you here? <laughs> slow down? <laughs> that sounds like something that says slow down. So right here on the left? All the way to the end, because he's seen walking down this way. So making the left down here, so. Down where? This, he, so he's yeah. seen pushing the barrel. Uh-huh. Going down this way. Okay, so we're gonna, what we're gonna do. What? That was just, I heard stop. It was like something screamed at us. I'm in your alley right now. Are you here with us? Are you here with us right now? They call you Clyde, but what is your real name? Is that really your name? Wheelbarrow Ghost. What is your real name? I don't think Clyde wants to talk to us. Clyde, you don't, why don't you want to talk to us? Because, because Wilbur. Holy shit, dude. I said because Wilbur, I swear to God, that's why I think I love bro. Jake, did you hear that? Yeah, I did. Because Wilbur? I, I heard because Wilbur, kind of. Who's, who's here right now? There's Mo, Joey, and who else? Fine. You don't want to talk to me, that's all right. I guess I'll go and take your wheelbarrow. That's creepy. I don't think he wants to talk with us. Honestly, I go... Joey? Yo, I... Yo, that's a Joey. <coughs> Joey again, there it is. I came all the way here from Canada to talk to you and other ghosts in this house. Can you give me something? I don't know. All right, well, thank you for your time. This was your time to say something. No, nothing. All right, so we didn't get anything from the spirit box, you guys. Except Joey, Joey. Joey, Joey. And we heard wheel, wheelbarrow? Wheel, because wheelbarrow. Because we're wheelbarrow. I can't say that for some reason. So unfortunately, I don't think I captured the wheelbarrow man on camera.
What? Watch your head over here. Yeah. No I don't think I captured him on camera, but this was a, still a cool experience. I literally got to stay down here all by myself. And honestly, I'm, I'm, it's a privilege to do that. No one's really ever, oh my god, no, 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 no. no. Oh shit, okay, I, I, I felt like something just cheesed out for me down there. No one's really ever like stayed in the basement, like alone for five minutes. Five minutes in the basement and chill really kind of like, you know, made me realize that the darkness is scary. Back upstairs, where is everybody? I'm not sure. But that's hoping to, you know, no. what? You always trying to hide down here to scare you? What? I heard a whisper. Hello? Joey? Yeah. You're here? Yeah. Bro, I just caught a door slamming on camera. What are you talking about? Yeah. Come here, come here. I, I got that on camera. I caught a door slamming on camera inside. Follow me. It's, it sounded like there's somebody here, and they slammed the door. Where's Jake? So, I just got a door slamming on camera. Really? Yeah, I'll show it to you. So, we are outside right now, and I'm giving you guys a view of what it looks like out here. We actually have to get going. Um, we have no clue where Omar and Suzanne are. No, seriously, where are they? I don't know where they've disappeared. But look at how amazing this place is on the outside. This is the side that we actually didn't get a chance to go into. But maybe next time we come back here, we can do that. It'd be really cool though. I don't think I really showed you guys the outside properly. This is not amazing. We have no idea where Omar is. He's inside by himself with Suzanne doing God knows what with, with these ghosts. Do I, is that a light there? No, that's not a light. Hmm. You would see their lights if they were inside the house with their lights on. All right guys, making our way into a different part. Oh, oh my goodness. Well, this is creepy. We just made our way into like a different part of the Winchester house. And there's these really creepy mannequins here. I'm liking what I'm seeing. Remember that door? Has there ever been like ghost activities in here? That door. What we're door? here last time. Yeah, last time you were here. It would open and close on its own. Really? Every time we walked in, it was either like opening or closing. Maybe the mannequins did it. We've literally been looking for Omar forever. We have no clue where he is. He's been missing for like an hour now. Either they're trying to prank us or play a really creepy game, which is sick because like, we're doing, we're pretty much playing hide and seek in the Winchester Mystery House. Never been done before, let me just say. Hey Susan? Yeah. Oh, oh, there okay. you are. I found them. They're safe. Man, I was hoping something happened. Yeah. <sighs> What's up guys? How's it going? Not gonna lie, we were, we were so, like... We know what haunts that one room. Which yeah. room? The, the most haunted room here at the Winchester Mystery What's House. That? Jeff. I turn my I turn my spirit box on and I ask who haunts this room and very clear it said it, I think it said I do and then right after it said Jeff. Hmm. So Jeff a spirit by the name of Jeff. That's cool. Hmm. And when I went up to the fourth floor, I legit felt like a force field. It was almost like I started walking up the stairs and I almost felt like something was trying to push me. Hmm. And she told me that people have been pushed. Alright guys, that completes Episode two inside of the Winchester Mystery House. What a great experience. I'm honored to be here. I'm honored to be here with everybody, with Suzanne, with Jake, with Omar, with Joey. Shout out to everybody here. All the links are going to be down below. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed these adventures. Make sure to let me know if you guys did see something in the background, something that I didn't spot, something that none of us spotted. We did have a lot of creepy things happen. Smash the like button. I'll see you guys on my social medias, Twitter and Instagram, at Mosarchy. 
Be you, do you, stay positive, and just live a little. I'll see you guys later.